Uh, hi, I'm uh, Jack Nicholson, uh, the star of The Shining. Uh, today, the, the movie is a little, a little different, a little different than I remember it. I'm here to narrate and kind of explain what happened. Okay, so uh, we got to the hotel lasagna, and uh, uh, we met our tour guide, Mr. James. He was kind of weird. He held my hand, and I introduced myself. My name's Jack. This is my my wife. This is my son, Danny. He showed us around. This staircase was built in 1837 before the hotel was built. <laughs> Alright, there's a lot of snow out there, so you don't want to go out there unless you like the cold. I hate snow! Alright, then you're gonna hit it out there. You're gonna hit it! Now, in the game of pool, you want to hit all of the balls in before you hit the other guy's balls in. So see? Yeah, just like that. But you, you have to hit another ball first, so like... Oh! So see? Yeah? Alright. The legendary five point corner point. Are you crazy? Are you crazy? This is room 420. You don't want to go in there. Why don't I want to go in there? You don't want to know. Uh, so then we were left for the whole winter, and uh, it was uh, pretty hard at first to try to work on my writing, and I just really couldn't get anything done. Played a lot of wall ball. Uh, there were definitely some very low points. I tried to play ping pong, but I soon learned that I had nobody to play with. That was very challenging. Uh, my, my son Danny and my wife, they were having a hard time too, I think. Danny spent a lot of time with no friends, so he kind of just, he uh, rode his little scooter around the hotel. He started uh, seeing ghosts, I'm pretty sure. I, I don't know, something in the bathroom, but I really just didn't listen to him. Hey, Dad. Uh, but so one night I was having a nightmare, and my wife woke me up and said Danny was attacked by a ghost. It was crazy. <laughs> A ghost hurt him. You did it. You hurt Danny. I didn't hurt Danny. I didn't touch him. I didn't touch Danny. I didn't touch him. I didn't touch a hair on his head. I didn't touch him. So as you can imagine, things got pretty bad. I started drinking and going to bars. <sighs> Give me a, one of your finest liquors. Thank you. Just wanna play a game. Why I would love that. It's a risky game. Well, I'm alright with that. You could lose it all. We all fight our demons a little bit, right? And I'm the devil. And I spend a little bit too much time in the shower. But hey, we all have problems. Consider it a deal. After that deal, I was having a good time. I started playing ping pong with a good buddy of mine, uh, the devil. He was pretty good. Except I, I still couldn't really write anything. I was really uh, blanking on ideas. But you know, I kind of fudged the numbers, so to speak, and it kind of worked out. I think uh, my son kept uh, seeing the ghosts, and there was like one creepy ghost that would stand at the end of the hall. It seemed pretty uh, scary, but 
you know, I think he's kind of just a, a wussy if I have to be honest. And then I decided to kill my family for some reason. I think I'm forgetting part of the story, I don't remember. But that's how it kind of ended up in this situation. Here's the shining! <laughs> I actually don't think I killed them. I think I died in the, the wilderness or something. Man, it's so cold. I guess that's why they call it the shot. Hey, is it a little fuzzy in here? <laughs>